from NBC News, this is Today with Matt Lauer and Meredith Vieira. Protestant who spent himself for upwards of $25,000 apiece is going to be her. So we get started on a Thursday morning right here on Today. Back to you, Ryan. Got it. Autumn, it's crazy, isn't it? It's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> She's looking at the mother while you're doing it. She's like this. <laughs> She is a child prodigy and has been called an artistic genius and debuting on the Discovery Channel and selling more than $100,000 worth of paintings. Yeah, here's the catch. She's eight. <laughs> well, she is only in elementary school and she's already drawn a path to a very promising future. I had a chance to sit down with this incredible young local artist who's gaining some national attention. Now, there are plenty of people that, that think their child or grandchild's painting that's hanging on the fridge door is a masterpiece. But one mum and dad can now prove it. A lot of kids idolize artists like Justin Bieber, Miley Cyrus, Taylor Swift. But for nine-year-old Autumn DeForest, she prefers artists like Georgia O'Keeffe, Andy Warhol, and Jackson Pollock. And how did she start painting? Because I know you said she used leaves or kitchen utensils. She wasn't using a paintbrush, right? No, she wasn't. What she was... The pint-sized Picasso has made $300,000 on her art. We are back now at 748 with one of the art world's youngest stars at just eight years old, almost nine. Autumn has been painting for a few years now. Her style is being compared to abstract painters and even Andy Warhol. The divorce supplying Autumn with large canvases and paint. And in just three years, her works have encompassed an astonishing array of styles, from modern expressionism to surrealism to pop art. Autumn DeForest. Autumn DeForest. Autumn. Autumn is gifted. Autumn DeForest. Autumm DeForest. Autumn. Autumn. Autumn Autumn DeForest. Autumn, you've sold a lot of paintings with a lot of money. Good day. <laughs> Very good. Autumn's here along with your parents, Doug and Catherine. Good morning to all of you. You are a pistol. You are fun. You really are. I have three kids. Everything they draw and paint, I think, is a masterpiece. I'm not so sure anymore. I took a big, huge box of Crayola crayons and I rushed to my studio. I actually melted down the real crayons to do this. And when you paint it with that technique, it's called encaustic. It's pretty cool. Encaustic has its special little vibe. I'd say, personally, encaustic is just a fancy word of just painting with crayons. The one who really made it famous and really used it a lot was a very great artist, Jasper John. Let me introduce you to Autumn Tafaris. Today. Say, Autumn, how old were you when you started to paint? About in my late fives and fives. <laughs> how long does it take you normally to, to work on a painting? Like, say, say the Einstein painting. How long did it take for you to do that? Um, it is like that big. Two days. Also, there was, I guess, a painting that you did for Haiti. Is that true? Could you tell me a little bit about that? That is called Hope for Haiti. The earthquakes last year, that was just devastating to me. And I, I, I mean, what could I do to change that? And I thought, well, of course, make a painting. Make a painting of it. Do you sell your paintings? Do you people buy your paintings? Yes, yes. How much do they buy them for? Well, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm really not a money girl. I don't, I, I don't pay for the money. I don't pay for the money. Uh, I, I paint and people are generous enough to buy. My grandmother gave me um, this Barbie Marilyn. And I looked at her and I said, I could paint her. The original is called Mary. It's, uh, it was in the time of the Depression. I thought, well, if, if I could just take this really sad and depressed time and put my, since my favorite color is pink and, and it is, it's a joyful color, I want to take that, that theme and put it in a depressed time. 
to my personality is still there in a really sad time. That's awesome. That is awesome. What, what made you uh, come up with something like this? and wanted, want to do something like this. You're so amazing. Well, I thought um, at five, it kind of in my like, uh, late five, almost six, um, I thought, well, you know, I, I've, I've been through my toddler uh, phase, so I want to do something to, uh, to help the world and change the world. So I thought, well, you know, how about, how about painting? How about painting? So uh, I started in the garage, and I started my first painting called Equator, and I just started getting bigger, and my parents would put some acrylic and a paint and a little canvas in front of me, and I just, I'd make something out of that white canvas. I just love painting. Painting is like breathing to me. That's what I love. What kind of paint says it. That's this in classic. This is the exact same. Are you, those are crayons too? Yeah. I have a question. Can I have a hug? Sure. <laughs> sure. You're not going to ask for her autograph? It's a hug? Yeah. Me too. Oh, wow. You're going to get hugs. You're going to make a lot of new friends, Autumn. Do you think what you do, anyone else can do? Yes, anyone can do it. I mean, you just have to put your, your heart into it. Uh, and, and uh, everyone has the ability to do this. I did one more. Oh my God, I'm so excited. 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 Oh my God, I'm